Uh, Putin. You know Putin? I don't know Putin. We ain't on a first name basis. A viewer sends in a request to prank his friend that absolutely hates Donald Trump. This lady spends hours and hours making anti-Trump posts on Facebook. The requester set up a fake account pretending to be Russell from a fake Trump-owned Facebook group, urging her to take down all her anti-Trump posts. She got super paranoid and was convinced that she was being spied on by the Trump administration. So of course, I call her back and continue the prank as Vlad, a Russian hacker working for Trump. And before you go ham in the comments and accuse me of being a Trump supporter or hater, this prank shouldn't be taken as an indication of my political affiliation. I just think preachy people who try to aggressively force their views on others should be sometimes made fun of, on both sides. To put things into perspective, enjoy. Hello, Laura, how are you doing? Who is this? Uh, I am Vladimir. I'm actually calling with the Moscow branch of the Trump for President Foundation. How are you doing? You got the wrong number. Uh, no, Laura, there is no need to say a wrong number when you know it's right number. Like, there, there is no need for this. Why would you lie to me and say a wrong number? Because she told you the wrong number. Uh, no, but it's... Uh, who are you? You're not Laura. You sound like men. I, I am a man. But why are you using curse word? What's wrong with you? Did you wake up on the wrong side of I bed this morning? Hey, let me tell you what's wrong with me. Go ahead. <laughs> he hung up. I think that's her booty call, man. He's fucking... He just laid the pipe and she's like, Answer this for me. Let's call again. Hello? Uh, yes, Laura, the telephone got disconnected. I think that guy accidentally hung up telephone. Man, ain't you got something better to do? Uh, look, I, I'm calling. This is a matter of... Do you have something better to do? This is, this is my job. I, I'm Answer calling, the question. I'm calling from the Moscow... Of the Trump for President do you Foundation. have something better to do? This is my job. Answer the fucking question. Listen, you healed do you me. Have this something is my job. To do? Laura knows what she's been doing. She's been posting about President Trump. You all not... and Trump. Now I'm smearing Trump. Uh, you and Trump. Both uh, of you can eat a fat. What is Bye your name so I can take a note? What is your problem? Uh, yeah, hello brother, I am the supervisor here. I think there was some kind of language barrier with my other colleagues, so I was just calling to see if no, I can no, help No, no, it. no, it ain't you. It's a matter of national security. But why is it so important? Uh, because why is it so this, important? Is, this is my job, brother. I work directly with Vladimir Putin, and he told me... Who to... you work? You, you work with Vladimir who? Uh, Putin. You know Putin? I don't know Putin. We ain't on a first name basis. Uh, yeah, you no, know, but... he don't for me but you know who i'm talking so why about are you right? calling me on his behalf uh, because does, Bella, does, uh, Laura, does, does putin know me i don't does know, putin man. know me? what's your name i'll ask him Hold it. does he know me what's your so name why the f you calling well, me well, telling well, what's me your name brother you work for man why putin? do you have a stick up who your you ass man brother why do you have a stick oh, up your ass oh i Relax. know why why would putin care about me being negative about trump uh, no. if they don't if he you trying to tell me trump do have something to do with putin my brother, all I'm saying is we can give you like a no, quote No, no, unquote. no, my brother, my ass. Does, does Trump have something to do with Putin? Yeah, they're like best of friends, man. Like you see them, they talk to each they're other. Best of yeah. When do they hang out? So he's talking bad about what, Trump, what everybody knows. Know that, that Hold on. But Trump's Trump's a liar. Uh, but Trump, Laura, but Laura can, can, can you, Laura, can you get your booty call under control, please? Please, he's, he's speaking so loud, he's screaming, it's, it's so, my ear is hurting so much, please. Like, can I talk to Russell? Uh, do we have a Russell here? Hey there, Laura, how you doing? Oh, I'm good. How are you, Russell? I'm so good. Thank you for asking. I am going to be out of the office. We just wanted to ask because we noticed that you had some updated posts on your Facebook account. Just to, wanted to see, you know, if you would, you know, stop soon or if you're going to keep doubling down on your efforts to smear the president. Um, we Dude, just I haven't, I haven't even, I haven't even been on Facebook. I don't make that stuff up. Okay, well, we wanted to make it worth your while. Otherwise, we can go another route. But, you know, I, I prefer to avoid stage two and, like, you know, having a... Uh, you know, we don't want to... And, what, and what's stage two? Just stage two with Vladimir. You know, we just have to take it in a harder direction otherwise. I mean, we don't want to do that. I'm going to have Russians that are related to, to Vladimir Putin show up at my house. The fact of the matter is, you know, there's a current uh, impeachment effort, also more fake news, and we're just trying to kind of get ahead of it and figure out what's going on. According to our internal algorithm, you're one of the most influential anti-Trump campaigners in the state of So I'm just calling a kind of... Oh, that's bullshit. 
That's bullshit because I get it from somewhere. I don't make that crap up. All I'm doing is sharing funny posts I see on Facebook. If we can find some happy medium, you know, we can try to, you know, send you a nice little gift package or a nice little fruit basket, you know, if it'll help sway you in the right direction. We're happy to do that. Uh, Y'all ain't sending me If I see somebody that even might look Russian, I'm going to shoot first and ask questions later. Okay, okay, I mean, ma'am, Vladimir, do you want to try to convince her? Uh, ma'am, look, I, I'm, I want to, I want to, to help you. Off, uh, Laura, I'm hanging Laura, up the it's phone so important, now. Call Laura. me back after 5.30. Stage 5 Bye, is not I'm good, Laura. I'm glad you guys are okay. Love you. Uh, I love you too, Laura. But listen, I want to tell you to try to just help with this problem because we can't keep... Uh, hello? Oh my god. <laughs> She was going crazy on Facebook. She was literally posting angry Facebook status updates immediately after the call. I had the requester give her a ring to make her think that he was now being threatened by Russians too, and that they were coming after all her Facebook friends. What are you doing up this early? I know, right? Are you getting weird phone calls? Well, I keep getting a phone call from uh, somebody about my negative Trump post. Yeah, they keep calling me. Should I be worried? But I... Like, they sounded like they were getting ready, like, do some serious shit. like boy well, it's it, it's nice to know our our president is so secure in himself though right when he ended the call he's like we're going to be watching you that's our, like, our our government for you hello hey there laura how you doing who is this uh this is russell calling you back uh regarding the uh the facebook outreach program <laughs> Dude, how long are we going to keep doing this? Every time you guys call me, it makes me get online and post every negative Trump thing I can find. Ma'am, let me just uh, explain what happened. So, you know, my coworker Vlad was actually reprimanded by Putin himself for allowing you to continue. So, you know, he was actually sent to a, a Siberian gulag and, and, you know, it's, it's, he, he stopped. You really think I'm buying any of that? Well, well ma'am. Just well, stop calling okay, me. Okay, Stop look. calling me. You call me again and I'm going to make it my personal mission to find every anti-Trump thing I can find on Facebook and and share it. Man, because of I you, I fail my mission. I fail my mission because Here of Here we go with the... Ma Do not ma call me again. I'm turning all this in to the local authority, well, and it will be investigated. Well, ma'am, that, that's why we're, we're, no, we're no longer Don't calling call back. Ma'am, ma I have one last important note. You you were reported by one of your friends. One of your friends reported you as and, and to our organization. That's why I've been reaching out. Do you want to know which friend that was? Sure. Do you know somebody named Garrett? Yep. I see. Well, okay, the last thing I need to tell you, ma'am, was that this whole thing was indeed uh, just, just a prank uh, set up by your friend Garrett. I have Garrett on the line right now. That's, that's lovely. Um, well, ma'am, I'll... Tell I, I, Garrett I said to <laughs> stop, drop dead. I don't want to talk to him <laughs> no, or hear from him again. Ma'am, well, 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 just know that it was a joke. Um, nobody actually is tracking you from the Trump campaign. Well, guess what? It's not funny. I did not want to get you concerned. Garrett mentioned that you were... Really when good. you're telling me... When you tell telling me that Vladimir's gonna show up at my house, I'm not supposed to be upset by that. I, I know, but like, how believable was that? Like, it's ridiculous. You, you were calling it out and t talking about how absurd. It is but ridiculous. Are you at least somewhat relieved that this is all a ridiculous uh, attempt at a joke? No, I'm infuriated. Oh, I see. Well, is that? How well, it's too bad she was upset and took it poorly. The requester has apparently been her best friend for years and repeatedly told me that she was going to think this is hilarious afterwards. Well, guess who was wrong? It's too bad that politics have gotten so messy and dramatic lately. Maybe that's why she didn't find it funny that some dude named Vladimir wants to bring her an informational booklet to her front door. If you enjoyed the prank and the return of the Russian character, let me know by dropping a big like on this. If you want to request a prank of your own, the link to my website is down below, and I'll see you subscribers again soon.